Intel Guru Mark Z article, Is Floating the Currency a Solution to the Crisis of the High Dollar in Iraq? A representative explains, quote, There are calls to float the exchange rate in Iraq. Floating the currency is a procedure based on liberalizing the exchange rate, leaving it to market factors, supply and demand, to determine its value without any form of intervention by the economic authority. There are two types of floating, the first is absolute floating, and the second type is managed. Floating, i.e. the type in which the central bank intervenes to direct the exchange rate up or down, as it sees fit to achieve the interests of the national economy. Newshound Guru Claire Article, Is Floating the Currency a Solution to the Crisis of the High Dollar in Iraq? A representative explains, quote, There are calls to float the exchange rate in Iraq. Floating the currency means that the process depends on the liberalization of the exchange rate and leaving it to market factors represented by supply and demand, to determine its value without any form of interference or intervention by the economic authority. The kinds of floating are divided into two the first is absolute floating, and the second type is managed floating meaning the type where the central bank interferes to steer the exchange rate up or down, as it deems appropriate, to serve the interests of the national economy. Newshound Guru Jeff The Supreme Judicial Council has decided it's time for the present central bank governor to retire. Remember, this was his second term. In the first term, back in the year 2018, that is when he had printed the new lower smaller category denomination notes with his signature on them. But the only reason they put him back in for a second term was to commission the rate change. Now they're saying he is going to be forced into retirement. No date for retirement has been given, though. Intel Guru FRANK26 Sudani is working with the United States Treasury. In my opinion, the untied state's treasury is sitting in the chair of the CBI governor where ALAC normally sits. I find this to be a catalyst to see the untied state's treasury there. I'm very excited about what's going on. Newshound Guru Pimpy should he stay or should he go there is a lot of rumors and stories out there about ALAC resigning or he is being pushed out because he is old age, it's time for him to retire. Then you got people out there saying, oh, this is all fake news. Or maybe it is just the fact that there are some corrupt people still in government trying to grab control. of the Central Bank of Iraq, and one of the steps they have to first do is force Alak out. Is it possible these stories are circulating because they want Alak out? Did he really commit some of these crimes? All kinds of different scenarios took place. That s the deal with Iraq, you're not always 100% sure what really goes on. Newshound Guru Militia Man, article, referring Al Alak to retirement, a legal step or settling political scores it's been ongoing for the last few days there has been a suggestion that he was going to resign. There wasn't he any meat and potatoes to that dot then they went after his age. They said he was too old. Now they are talking as if there are some political scores doing this battle and using bad publicity. Certain people out there dot have made a lot of money and they're not going to make any more from the dollar auctions. They did it for a very long time.